Hi, welcome to SBAM's Ion Lansing. I'm Tony Stamas, Vice President of Government Relations for the Small Business Association of Michigan. And I'm Mike Marzano, Director of Government Relations for SBAM. And Mike, today we're at a different setting. We're at the Royal Park Hotel in uh, Rochester, Michigan. Uh, we've got a retreat here with SBAM, with our Board of Directors, taking a look at where we're at in terms of representing and serving small businesses and where we need to go. So uh, an exciting time, a, a great group of individuals really giving us valuable feedback and, and, and guidance as we move forward as an organization. But uh, certainly a very busy week in Lansing, uh, highlighted the governor's state of the state address. And uh, obviously Flint continues to be front and center. Uh, the governor made a, a, an apology and a commitment to remedy what's been happening in Flint. And so that, that's been the center part for the discussion. They, uh, the federal government's looking at intervening, uh, just been recently announced putting $80 million into uh, assisting the state uh, house passed quickly last week, a $20 million supplemental to deal with some of the issues and expected to be taken up in the state Senate next week. So it was uh, very much uh, Flint focused in terms of what's happened and what can be done to, to fix it and to work with the community going forward. But there were other topic areas in the state of the state. Absolutely, Tony. The governor got into some economic development issues uh, that's going on around the state uh, from north to south. He talked about the Sioux locks and wanting to the federal government to invest more money to expand those. And also talked about Willow Run and having that be at Michigan being the leader in the development of the autonomous vehicle. So some very exciting things that were on the forefront of Tony. Yes. So we'll see, and I think we'll, some more of the ideas that maybe didn't get talked about in the state of the state, we'll see those uh, unrolled in, in the weeks of had, ahead and certainly the continued focus on Flint and uh, finding solutions to what's happened there. Also, we're kind of getting to the point where in just a few weeks we'll see the, the unveiling of the governor's budget presentation, and that'll really set the path for the budget year coming up. So uh, a busy time. We appreciate you joining us today. And as always, please give us your feedback, your thought, and your insights. Have a wonderful day. Take care.